Hello there, I'm Matteo, the Chief Mobile Opinionist here at Tech Travel Geeks. And this is the Tech Travel Geeks unboxing and first impressions of the Paloview Lightning headphones and earphones for Apple devices. That means that this is a pair of wired earphones with a lightning connector. That's probably because Apple are trying to kill off the courage port that we like so much and people with iPhones who do need wired earphones will have to purchase a made for iPhone or MFI uh, or MFI device to be able to use uh, their earphones and their smartphone as a media player. So what we're going to do is unbox the earphones and then give you some first impressions after they've been in use for a while. If you don't already, please do subscribe to the Tech Travel Geeks here on YouTube. Right then, so the packaging as arrived from Amazon is pretty straightforward. It's a cardboard box with a tray on the inside and that tray has quite a lot of stuff in here. So let's start off with what's in here. So we've got, like our product, scan the, the QR code, great. Okay, so we'll do that later, I'm sure we will. The earphones themselves are pretty nicely presented in this plastic holder. Let's pull up that. And I chose the red color. These are available in all black. So that where you have the red connector here, you, you have them available in black, as well as in white. Obviously, if you're an Apple aficionado, maybe white is the better color for you. You've been brainwashed into it since uh, the original iPod, probably. But here we have the black cable for the made for iPhone or MFI uh, earphones with lightning. So let's undo these and have a look. So nice little wire uh, holder here. It does the job. So on one side, we have your traditional lightning connector. There we go, we let the autofocus do its thing. Uh, there's a little label here, I'm going to take that off. R-O-H-S. If you know what R-O-H-S stands for, do let us know in the comments section below this video, whilst I take off this sticker. There we go. So we've taken off the sticker. Let's have a look at what else there is here. There's a controller in the line, so it's a line controller with an action button for answering calls or pausing your music. And then you also have the volume rocker, so you can control that from the earphones themselves. And then you have the, the, the earbuds themselves. These are magnetic. They clip on together. So we'll need to see how that works. And more importantly, these do have a microphone in the Paloview branded uh, inline controller. So you can use these for video calls and uh, for uh, invoking whatever digital assistant you use. I believe Siri is still the thing on Apple. So that's probably your thing if you're an Apple user. And then you have your sort of soft Paloview branded bag for carrying the earphones around, which is quite handy when traveling. It avoids your earphones getting tangled in other things. And then you have the usual uh, earplug adapters, different sizes. Let's have a look at these. So with the red ones, you get red detailed ones with the red inner silicon tip in on the inside and then the sort of darker gray on the outside. So this is large and small and medium is already applied on the earphones themselves. So let's see what happens when you plug them into an iPhone. And I'll pick up my iPhone 12. Let's see what happens when I plug them in. So it says, is this lightning adapter connecting a pair of headphones? If you switch devices, you can update this selection in the sounds and haptic section, section of settings. So this is headphones. Great, done. So what I'm going to do now is plug these in uh, to my ears 
and listen to some music, podcasts, audiobooks. Uh, see if there's any content on YouTube uh, to see if there's any lag between what I see on the screen and what I hear in my ears. Uh, and then I'll be back in a moment to give you some uh, first impressions of how I find these earphones. So, speak to you soon. Right then, I'm back. And over the last hour or so, I have been using these earphones from Palaview to use Clubhouse. I was listening to Jason Calacanis' uh, Clubhouse uh, room. I was listening to music, uh, my usual playlist, which I'll link to in the description to this video, as well as to some audiobooks. I'm currently listening to Look Who's Back uh, on Audible, as well as a Twit podcast. I was catching up with Sunday's Twit. And I have to say, overall, these are a good pair of earphones. They're not amazing. They tend to be a little less bassy than many other ones. But I have to say, the overall quality and accuracy, in my impression, is very, very good. Uh, a few observations. The cable is relatively slim, but sturdy. And the lightning connector feels good and quite stable inside the lightning port of the iPhone 12. Uh, I was using it with my case that we have previously uh, reviewed here on the Tech Travel Geek, so no issues here. Uh, this is the Louis Bohr case for the iPhone 12. And I have to say, overall, nothing to complain about. Good quality sound. It worked. They worked quite well. Uh, it was good to be able to quickly take them out of my ears and then have them magnetically click together when not in use. But when you do that, there is no feedback. The iPhone doesn't pause uh, the audio source in the phone itself, unlike other wireless earbuds that we've used, which have similar magnetic clips. Uh, they actually perform an action, such as pausing your music when you do so. So, apart from that, all good. I also made a very brief video call to a friend, and I have to say the sound quality was decent for me, and they seem to be able to hear me, so no issues there. So I can definitely recommend these Paloview earphones from uh, Amazon. We'll put a link in the description to where you can purchase them. And uh, I'll put any other relevant links in the, the description to this video. If you'd like to know more, um, if you would like to uh, ask us anything or give us some feedback, leave a comment in the section below and we'll do our best to get back to you. So I think we'll wrap things up here. Uh, if you don't already, please do subscribe to the Tech Travel Geeks here on YouTube. We cover consumer electronics that we believe make the travel experience better, such as earphones, but also smartphones, also uh, gadgets such as power banks and cables and chargers and cameras and cars. So a bit of everything really things that we think are gadget-like and which make the travel experience better. But for now, thanks for watching and goodbye from us.